Okay guys, I'm going to show you everything you need to make a carboy cleaner. It also works on Sankey kegs, corny kegs, 15.5s, 5.5s, 7.5s, everything. It's super simple. Uh, it's really cheap. The pump is Harbor Freight and Tool. Uh, here's your pump. This is the first stage that has the half inch threaded uh, adapter to it. Uh, with the when it's on sale and 20% off, it's like 22 bucks for the pump. This one's been running for it's probably been three years. It's been cleaning everything. So then, what you have to do is you go to the sprinkler section and you get the 18 inch sprinkler pipe, and it'll be threaded on both ends. And then you go to the plumbing section and you get the white plastic cap. Now this white plastic cap you'll have to sand down in order for it to fit inside the uh, carboy. Um, then what you can use sorry had to get my beer um, you're gonna need one of these dryers for six bucks you can use one of these paint buckets from Lowe's or Home Depot. The only problem is this little dimple in the bottom will make your pump uh, sit off center. Um, but this is like four bucks, I think. And then any five gallon bucket will work just because it'll splatter a little bit. I'm using this, this one because I'm not making any beer right now. So you put your pump together, that's all set. You take your plastic bucket and you set it down. Now I've already used warm tap water or hot tap water and PBW, that's already been mixed. Here I'll show you this outside the bucket first. So this guy So I got that stainless steel bucket because it has a flat bottom. You don't need to have it. You can work it with the plastic one if you want. The store by me sells these dirt cheap. So that's what I used. So you take this guy. You put him inside your bucket. You take your pump. You insert your pump into the bucket. You take your dryer, you set your dryer right on top of the uh, stainless steel bucket or the plastic bucket. Fits on them perfectly either one. And you take your carboy, obviously you clean all the sludge out of the bottom. Whoops. That's what the ex-wife always said, I could never find the hole. So, you put your vessel that you want to clean on top, you plug it in, and there you go. Now you're cleaning your carboy. You walk away, you do whatever you want to do. It's literally, what, 22 bucks plus 6, uh, it's 28 plus, I don't know. To three bucks for the for the bucket so you're at 31 plus the fittings another five 36 bucks you got a perfect little carboy and keg cleaner I hope this helps you out hope you enjoy your beer cheers